I, in fact, did. Shout out to all the veterans out there. We truly appreciate what you have done for us and this country. And on that note, time to get into some news. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Listen up. You need to update your iPad now. If it is not updated by Thursday, November 13th, you will start to have restrictions on your iPad. You will still be able to update your iPad, but the internet will be turned off at school and at home. Attention all BFF participants, there has been a schedule change. The next party is November 12th, which is this Wednesday. The party will be held at White River Christian Church from 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. If you have any questions, you can text Abigail Essig or Re Rebecca Hammond. Hola, there is a Spanish club meeting on Friday, November 14th at 1.35 in room 1238. Any Spanish student is encouraged to attend. See Miss Solis or Mrs. Pasa for a pass to the meeting. Any sophomore interested in being NHS's representative in next June's Hugo O'Brien Leadership Seminar may pick up information in the guidance office and have it turned in by November 14th. As the chosen sophomore, you will engage in hands-on leadership activities, meet leaders from the state of Indiana, explore personal leadership skills while learning how to lead others, and make a positive impact on the community. Take advantage. Tickets for NHS's production of Fiddler on the Roof are available in the main office during regular school hours, then from 3 to 8.30, and they will be sold in the auditorium left door entrance. All seats can be reserved, $10 each. Performances are Thursday, November 13th at 7 p.m., and Friday and Saturday, November 14th through 15th at 7.30 p.m. Are you interested in learning about transferring credits from Ivy Tech to IUPUI through the Passport program? Want to talk to college students and staff about life and activities on IUPUI campus? Well, you might be interested in a field trip to the IUPUI campus on November 22nd from 9 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. This Saturday, November 15th, there will be a dodgeball tournament at the East Middle School starting at noon until it's over. Ages will be five and up, and teams of six to eight players are encouraged to attend. Teams are encouraged to dress alike for the awards that will be handed out. Anyone and everyone is welcome to join, and it's only $10 a person. This event will go towards Emily Smart's mom, who is fighting cancer. For any other questions or more information, please contact Haley or Megan Lutz. Well, NHS, that's all we got for you. Now on the birthdays, lunches, and sports. Peace, NHS. Jake from State Farm. Nice khakis. Oh, you're right. Let's get in some sports. Saturday, November 8th, NHS cheerleaders went to Southport to compete in their state competition. The girls stepped up and brought home some hardware, coming in third. Way to go, ladies. We are proud of you. We are proud of you. <laughs> the boys' lacrosse team ended their fall outdoor season with a conference tournament. The boys went 1-2 and two on the day, winning against Westfield, but losing to Fishers and HSE. Good luck and get ready for the spring. Boys track and conditioning for sprinters, jumpers, and hurdlers will continue this week. Conditioning will meet in the upper balcony of South Gym tonight and Thursday from 3 to 4.30. Shout out to the girls basketball team as they travel to Arsenal Tech High School to face the Titans for their first game tonight. Then, this Friday, everyone better be here at the mill for their first home game against Heights. That's all we got for you today. Peace out, NHS.
Hey, NHS. It's that time of year again. Falling leaves, good food, and warm family hugs. And it's time to thank your favorite people at NHS for their unconditional friendship. Thanks for always being there for me. Oh my god. <laughs> Get him a gobble grill. Thanks for letting me dance on a 46 degree angle at homecoming. Get him a gobble grill. Thanks for downloading my mixtape. SoundCloud. Get him a gobble grill. Thanks for not scrolling to the left. Get him a gobble grill. Gobblegrams are Thanksgiving-themed thank you notes you can send to a person of your choice with a personalized message and a piece of candy. We're selling them for one dollar at lunch this week, so make sure you get yours. Look at all those chickens!